Well, welcome back. This time on the Engine Master's Engine Build for the Automotive Department, we are going to do a couple of major tasks. Uh, one of them is going to be we're going to set the, the cylinder block up and uh, get it ready to finish hone. That's a four-step process that we use to get to the desired size of uh, fitting the pistons of the cylinders. And also what we're going to be doing is cutting valve seats in the, in the heads that we're going to be using for this project. So a couple of pretty in-depth items will take up a little bit of time and kind of explain what we're doing along the way. So let's get at it. Okay, what Jim's doing here is he's actually setting up our uh, valve seat cutting tool fixture. And the tool cutting bits that we'll be using are kind of a multi-angle uh, approach to the exhaust and intake valve seats. Um, basically has to maximize cylinder flow, contact patch area on the valve. And it's, a, it's very precise. It has to be done exactly correct in order to get um, what we need to have to optimize the flow of the cylinder head. So that's kind of a timely, time consuming process. So as soon as he gets done to it, he'll get over to the bench and start cutting some seats. What I'm doing over here now is I'm setting up the uh, cylinder home to do the finishing on the, on the cylinders for this engine. And what I have is a fixture sitting inside the block. We use a four step process, a roughing stone, a semi-finished stone, a finished stone, and then what we call plateau honing. Um, I'll get this tooling all set up. We'll actually put a torque plate on top of the block which simulates the cylinder head being bolted onto it. And then we'll hone the block to the finished dimension that we decide we need to, to have, the, have at it. Okay, what Jim's getting ready to do now is uh, he's setting up the sun and seat and guide machine. You have to actually level the machine and the head with each other so that you get an absolutely accurate uh, cut on the seat in reference to the valve guide. So he's kind of, it's kind of a really intricate process here to get the best job. And once he gets the head all leveled out, he will get the seat cutter installed and then you'll begin cutting the seats. Okay, that's going to wrap it up for this uh, episode on our Engine Masters project. Uh, Jim's got the valve seats cut on the head and he'll actually go in and do some finished port work on those. We'll get into that a little bit more next, next episode. He'll kind of go over some, some of the ins and outs of uh, cylinder head port work, which is extremely important in this case because airflow is pretty much the name of the game. And also, uh, the cylinder block here will be all finished up and ready to, to fit our pistons uh, in the next episode. And also you'll get to see uh, the actual beginnings of balancing the crankshaft for this assembly. So that's going to be it for now. So we'll see you next time.